What is popping, you beautiful people? Hope y'all doing great, doing fantastic, all that good stuff. I don't know what that's going on with my head right here, but I felt like picking the camera up. I am. Uh, I just woke up and I'm going to the gym. So uh, I took a couple days off from the gym. I've been kind of lazy with going to the gym, but my diet has still been pretty strict. Um, I took maybe like one cheat day and uh, didn't affect me at all, which is great. Um, honestly, it helped. It helped with everything else going on. I actually, I think I lost like a pound or two, which is absolutely insane. Um, but we're going to the gym now. I just felt like picking the camera up and just talking to y'all and saying, hope y'all doing great, doing fantastic, all that good stuff. Uh, the last few days, I have not been motivated to do anything. I don't know what's going on. Um, maybe it's like something to do with the supplements that I was taking and then I stopped taking it. Um, I, I truly don't know, but we're going to the gym. I'm feeling good. Um, I'm still a little tired, but we're going to get up. We're going to go to the gym. I need to get a haircut. Maybe I'll do that after the gym. All in all though, let's make our way to the gym. Two hours later. What a day, what a day, what a day. It's just leaving the gym now. Whew, I feel good. What a great time. I don't know. What a great freaking workout I had. Um, definitely was in there for about an hour and a half or so getting it in. It was definitely really good. But now I'm going to make my way back to the house, get some food because I'm getting hungry. So let's go back to the house now. 12 seconds later. Now we're going to be going into, you can't really see it right there. There you go. That juice place right there. I've never been here before. So I'm going to go try it out. I'm just in the mood for a smoothie or like a, like a juice or something. So something a little healthy to hold me off until I get home. So let's go. So I went in there. I got me a protein shake. It's called the protein packer. It has like chocolate, peanut butter. Um, I think it has like 30 grams of protein or something overall in it. Um, and then I got a ginger shot. I've never did one of these before. They said, what do you want on it or whatever? And I said, I don't know. There's two different kinds of things I guess they put in them. And I said, whatever is like the best, I guess. I was like, I just heard it's spicy. So I'm gonna try this first, see how it tastes. It has bananas in it. it, has a bunch of other stuff in it. It's really freaking good. It's like, I don't know, it has like soy milk, I think, or um, as almond milk and uh, some other stuff. But got my water here. I'm gonna try this ginger shot now. It does not look the greatest, honestly. So here we go. I heard it's like super spicy. If you've, ever, if you've ever had a ginger shot, let me know in the comments down below. I don't even want to smell it. I just want to go for it. Okay, here we go. Actually, it doesn't smell bad. It doesn't smell bad at all. Okay, I'm getting nervous. Here we go. If you all know me, I'm like super picky too, so I don't know if I'm going to like it or not. Oh. Oh. Okay, so <clears throat> whoo, whoo, makes my nose run. Uh -huh. That shit tasted like laundry detergent or something, like some kind of freaking detergent. Holy moly. Whew. All right, well, it was a little spicy. It wasn't like bad though. It wasn't bad. It's just like, I don't know how to explain it. It tastes like a freaking chemical. This is way better. I mean, let me know if ginger shot. I know if everyone tells me they're really good for you and stuff like that. It helps you like keep your keep your immune system really good. I think everyone was telling me. I don't know. It's just like everyone said they're really good for you. Um, but honestly, holy freaking crap. That thing kicked the shit out of me. <laughs> Whew. I don't know, y'all. Let me know, like I said, in the comments down below if you've ever had a ginger shot before. Because it tastes kind of like freaking... Uh, it tastes like some kind of cleaning product. Oh. Anyways, though, we're going to make our way home. I'll see you guys at the house. What's happening, y'all? Hope you're doing great. Doing fantastic. All that good stuff. So, just left the grocery store. You can't really see it over there. But there's the grocery store. I think about going over to the Walmart here in a second. Got a bunch of groceries. But as I was leaving, I looked over at the lottery machine, as I always do. And this was sitting in the bottom of the freaking machine. One dollar freaking ticket. So, someone left it in there. Um... We're gonna see if we can get a big win on it though. Uh, ticket number 32, you can win up to 500 bucks on this ticket. It says 75% payout. So 
I'll scratch it off and I'll see if we get a win. All right, so we didn't win. We had two twos, two fives, a one, and a 10. You need at least three of the same number to match, and uh, we didn't get that. But it was still pretty cool to find a lottery ticket just sitting in the machine like that at the bottom. I've seen that like a, probably like three times in my life, um, but still really cool though. Uh, I wish we would have won 500 bucks. That would have been an epic video, but we didn't. We still found a ticket, just chilling in the machine at the bottom. I would have filmed it, but it's super busy in there, and I didn't want to make a scene or anything like that. So I just picked it up and then brought it out here and scratched it. So, yeah, there it is. I am back home now, and when I went to the store, I got some Dunkaroo cereal. Yes, I got two boxes of this. I haven't ate cereal in probably... I don't know, maybe like two and a half months. Um, everything's been pretty clean. Um, but yeah, I'm going to try it and see how it tastes. So I figured I would uh, film it for y'all. So here's what they look like. They're like little cookies. I don't know how to really explain it, but yeah, let's try them. They taste kind of like the cookie crisp. If you guys don't know what cookie crisp is, I'll put it up on the screen right up there. It literally tastes just like the cookie crisps, but without the chocolate. Pretty good though. But I'm gonna fill this freaking thing up. I got the serving sizer cup right here. I'm gonna put a couple servings in there and uh, I'm gonna eat it. So uh, yeah, I'm definitely still trying to be strict with my diet. This is the first like junk food thing I've had in a long time. So yeah, it is what it is. We'll see how my body reacts to it. There's three cups. I think that's what I'm gonna eat right there. Three cups of what the hell is that <laughs> what in the world is that <laughs> oh my god that is that's scary looking let's see if mom will eat it here try this are your hands clean yep give it a try <laughs> give me a what the fuck <laughs> get out of here how's that one taste <laughs> she's leaving out of we're out of here all right y'all so moment of truth we're gonna try it with the milk so let me know in the comments down below. Do you put your cereal in and then the milk or do you put your milk in and then the cereal? Um, but even with all this cereal right here, I still didn't cap out my calories for today. So if I do get hungry later, I can go make like some chicken or something, but really cool. Still got over like 200 calories even after I eat a 600 or what is this? Like four or five, 600 calorie uh, meal. So yeah, here we go. I'm telling you it's really good but it tastes just it tastes just like the cookie crisp so i'd recommend it pretty good definitely pretty good so all right i'm gonna enjoy this kick back relax hopefully y'all enjoyed this video i'm gonna end it here um all in all though a bunch of crazy stuff happened with the last couple days i guess um found that lottery ticket that's pretty crazy uh found the cereal that's pretty crazy it's hard to find the cereal like i didn't even expect walmart to have it um, they also had a box of, um, I think, Little Yachty, um, what's that, uh, Reese Puffs? I didn't grab them, though. I thought maybe for a Reese, I thought about grabbing them, but um, I was like, nah, I don't want to mess with it. But I do have one more box of these over there, sealed. So if you're interested in a box of um, this Dunkaroo stuff, let me know down in the comments below. We can work out a deal, and uh, I'll, get you, I'll get it out to you. So definitely big thank you to everyone who's watched the video at this point. Appreciate y'all. Like I said, every single day though, keep on keeping on. Don't let anyone bring you down. We'll see you tomorrow. Peace.